surging at the side of the boat, white mane in the mouth. Hey, look. Life goes on. Yellow, the agony of the final moments. But red, the few minutes quick if it's a big man, that big man, that there was no higher snake here. It's all over there. Yes, so sorry to this people. They can't have been fired for that life. So how do you, how do you, how do you, I think um, I get this as shot at all. Because you're a superhuman, you identify with God. So I think that we just have to be there. In 1944, during my first trip to Cuba as a child, I observed that different orders of reality appear to stop the dreams set by God. A painter may create a secret order of things where different strokes suggest a gathering of masks and sleep animals. Ancestral spirits do not accept ritual and magic expressed in hallucinating forms scattered on the canvas. Pseudo African prophets masquerade as art critics and scholars of true art are distinguished by their power to surprise, to synthesize, synthesize different mediums of dreams. This experience is widened by the violent reaction of the castle. So, and that is what we see in the quest for science. And then there are questions that have not been answered by science and religion. So, we have this specific approach of the fight to feed them. Thank you for staying for this session. Today's conversation will really explore the idea of language and memory when it comes to poetry. So I'm really excited to hear from our guests. I, I discovered that when it comes to translation, if your language is so difficult, a lot of things will be lost. In 1944, during my first trip to Cuba as a child, I observed that different orders of reality appear to disturb the dreams beset by the Orisha. It was many years later before I knew that sun, sea, salt, and grit. I stood on the grand balcony and smoked critic cigarettes. They felt the cool tiles on their feet. How many minutes will I lose listening to the laughter spilling from the perseverance for strangers ask, where is your father? He lay next to blow hands and pull hands to the Oava. The sea is a strange thing. I've been trying to understand the idea of home, what it means to me, and why you are willing to lose all for, for a few words. So now that uh, people know that younger poets can get uh, enterprises and stuff like that, they'll take more chances. They wouldn't only go for the established name. We'd be able to pick anybody and say, ah, listen, we think we like your poetry. Give us the manuscript. So it's a victory for all of us. As a family, we have that coming of age phase. And it's something that you need to His, his approach was 
uh, he said he wouldn't buy school shoes without school fees. You wouldn't buy school uniform without school fees. You wouldn't buy this without school fees. So why would you? So the idea was take a education policy. Well, so so that